magic is. The city is ours. An end to male domination, my sisters. To freedom! Lost in the Devil's Triangle. Trapped in a dimension with beings from the future and from other worlds. A party of adventurers journeys through zones of time back to their own time. Varian, a man from the 23rd century, possessing awesome powers. From 1977, Fred, a young doctor just out of medical school. Scott Jordan, the 13-year-old son of a famous scientist. Liana, daughter of an Atlantean father and an extraterrestrial mother. And Jonathan Willoway, rebel scientist from the 1960s. Together, they face the frightening unknown on The Fantastic Journey. Yeah, we can use more of these places. I think I'm going to take Salel for a walk so he can stretch his legs. All right, don't go too far. Don't worry, we'll be careful. seen him so upset. There must be a reason why he left her. Hmm. Let's go. You know, we have been following Silel on blind faith. I mean, he could just be interested in a mouse or something. No, not where Leanna's concerned. New travelers. We're uh, just passing through. Do we, we need your permission? Not at all. That is Coriel, our home. You must come and be made properly welcome. We're looking for a woman from our party who's disappeared. Could she be down there? A woman? Was she a slave? No, we're a slave. A servant, then, a wife? Mm, no, scarcely that, either. 
Why do you worry about her if she's not your property? Because she's our friend. Your friend? My men are all through these woods. If she's there, they'll find her and bring her to us. But while we wait, please accept our hospitality. All right. <laughs> <laughs> this concern for the woman you lost is very amusing. Don't you find it so, Haryana? <laughs> hey, this is taking too long here. If Liana isn't here, we're going to have to go find it. She could be lost, she could be hurt, anything. I'm having my captain's report as soon as they come in. Please understand us. If Liana is here, we would like to see her. Since this woman is so important to you, I'll have my cells checked immediately. I'll have it brought to you. <laughs> <laughs> you don't seem to have too much regard for women in your society. Regard? What is regard? Tell them, Haryana. Are you not adequately clothed and fed? Do you want for anything? And all this in exchange for those labors for which nature has suited you. <laughs> <laughs> Our lives are most acceptable. If my lord will excuse me. Mm. Why should Liana be locked up? If she hasn't done anything wrong. Ah, you're young yet. You have much to learn. She's only a woman. <laughs> <laughs> I activated the complex and got scanner readouts on all of the new men. They're not complete, but... Jonathan Willoway is a mechanical engineer, a scientist. The man Varian and the man Fred Walters are both physicians. They are all different from our men in their attitudes. That doesn't mean that they'll just stand by when our revolt comes. The complex read they're more concerned with proceeding to the east and returning to their own times. This complex was built by men. Our revolt depends solely on your work with this complex. We must make those changes. Yes, Your Majesty. The new girl can probably be trusted, but we can't take any chances on the men. Are we completely ready? All sections of the city can be taken as soon as Adria completes her work on the complex. father was one of your builders. I was taught his craft and have been given clearance to service you. There has been no work order to service me. You simply haven't seen it. I monitor everything. From now on, you won't have to. How long do we have to wait? I mean, it's been an hour. Red. What's an hour in the interest of scientific knowledge? Uh, this complex you were talking about, is a computer of some sort? Yes, to help run our city. It was built by our men and responds only to men.
Hold your majesty. Three men. We were talking in the courtyard when they all... What evil magic is this? came here merely as a traveler. I'm sorry that you were ill-treated, but I was powerless to prevent it then. Now you are free to go or stay, if you wish. What about them? Oh, they must stay. They're different from the other men we knew. They'll provide excellent breeding stock for our colony. Now, you see here, I will not be referred to as breeding stock. You better be silent, or you will be materialized. I suppose you want to stay here with them. This is just the kind of place you've been looking for. What? You know what I mean. You've been hanging on to us, letting us be your gentlemen, watching us fetch and carry for you and never doing your own fair share of anything. What? There he is. No, it's true, Scott. She even has you doing twice your normal share for her. And now she's found the perfect place to lord it over all of us. I've had enough of their male arrogance to last a lifetime. Your Majesty, I would like to stay. You are welcome to join us. But make no mistake about it, you have to report for work like the other women. Colonel, place these men under strict watch. But do not confine them lest they cause trouble. And make sure they're fed. Where did the complex put the men? I don't know, Your Majesty. I don't even think the complex knows. Something has gone wrong. Complex builders, Your Majesty. They're only the women. Yes, only the women. This is how Yana's doing. I got my hands on her. And what if she never lets us out of here? There still has been no maintenance order on me, Adria. Why are you changing some of my components? The maintenance and service orders have been delayed for a short time. Queen Haliana authorized these changes. You are not a builder. You are a woman. I have been cleared to maintain and repair you. That is so. dishes should keep the men satisfied. I see you're adding more herbs. That man Willoway knows a great deal about using common herbs as spices. He complained a lot at the last meal. Putting in more spices will help conceal the taste of the poison. So far, none has refused a meal. They haven't felt the pain or the nightmares of the poison, nor do they understand that they have to stay here now. 
Are you sure about this? Yes. I was going into the kitchen to maybe get a snack or something when I heard Connell and Maisel talking about it. The queen was trained by one of the physicians when she was still a princess, so she knows everything about poisons. It's a wonder she hasn't knocked off her husband before this. Instead, she uses the stuff on us. So there must be an antidote. I mean, if it is poison, we have to find out what that antidote is and take it with us when we leave. It's not going to be that easy. They're putting it in all our food. It stays in your body, so if you don't get it regularly, the poison will kill you. Oh, that's great. Fred, if you had a sample of this poison analyzed, do you think you could offset it? Maybe, if I also had my medical kit. I mean, we left everything by that stream when we came after Liana. That's right. Let's concentrate on getting the sample first. Well, I can get them. I can get a sample somehow. summoned me as your night visitor? Do you remember where I called you from? It was a dark place. It was like a prison. Why was I there? Because you and your men did corrupt and evil things. Because you mistreated and used and abused every woman you ever came in contact with. Oh, I could not do that. I respect women. More than that, I respect you. And I love you, my wife. Why couldn't you have been like this all the time? Why couldn't you have been like that all the time? Is there any way to remove or blank out the watchers? I'm afraid I'd have to go to the main body of the complex. Doesn't seem to be an answer here. There have been incidents all over the city. I'm sorry, Your Majesty. I'm not one of the complex builders. I know only what my father taught me.
You must repair the complex. I don't believe I have the skills, Your Majesty. I've already caused it harm once. I don't think it'll let me back in there again. That watcher <laughs> came right for me. Only the complex could make it do that. It's time to talk to Willoway. And the man from Earth's future, Varian. He might know what to do. I know something about medicine, but I've seen nothing like this. How does it work? It's attuned to my thought waves and energy patterns. It's completely useless in anyone else's hands, and I wish that you would return it to me. If you want it back, show me how it works. I just can't do that now, Your Majesty. You refuse a direct command? That is insolence I will not tolerate. Take him away to await punishment. Master Willow. Master? Oh, my, 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 my. What have I done to earn that? It's what you are going to do, Master Will. There's a problem. The complex has become very uh, undependable. Complex readout on you said that you did work on computers for the NASA space program, whatever that is. Yes, I worked for NASA and JPL and Caltech. I was a man of many parts. It used to be a joke. Is it repairable, Master Willoway? No. Complex said that you were highly skilled at computer mechanics. Well, I am. But you see, <laughs> Bria's fooling around with this. It, it's burned out a lot of its components. Unless you happen to have some of them hidden around here somewhere. No. No, the, the complex is complete. There are no other components. Well, then I am afraid I cannot repair it. Cannot or will not? No, I, I don't understand, Your Majesty. <sighs> You're a man. No man has ever helped us. Your Majesty, whatever your grievances are, I do not share them. I would repair it if I could. If you want to see your friend again, you will. Your Majesty, I am trying to tell you I cannot repair this the way you want it. Now, this machine has a mind of its own, possibly because of Andrea's changes. And I am afraid that that mind may not be sane. That's impossible. It is a clear and present danger. Now, you yourself saw the damage on the readout. For refusing to repair the complex, you will join your friend in prison. I got it out of the kitchen when Maisel was gone. What do you think? I think I need that test kit in my medical bag. Will that do the job? It's the only chance we got. Look, stay here and hide this. Good job, partner. Find the man, Fred. No. Even the young males cannot be trusted. You steal, you turn against me and my women. Just like all men. Turn against you? You're poisoning us. Put him in the cells with his friends.
down slowly. Put your hands over your head or I'll send you right through. Man, I am getting so tired of your act. <laughs> Just checking your reflexes. Okay, you got a bruise on your head. It needs some attention. Are you going to kill me? No. My trip is keeping people alive. It's much more rewarding. I've even got a license. Though I don't guess it matters much here. I don't understand you. That makes us even, baby. Just hold still now. Are you in love with me? Uh, no. I mean, you are one attractive lady, but uh, we don't really have a lot in common. What, what made you ask that? Because you could have killed me or left me here. Why else would you try to save me and heal me? Listen, lady, there's a lot of open territory between being lovers and mortal enemies. You and I can have a lot of different feelings for each other. Hey, I think we already do. But I can like some things about you and I can dislike others. I mean, we can be indifferent toward each other, we can be friends, there's all kinds of stuff that can happen. Not, not in Queen Haleana's kingdom. Yeah, well, see, that's her problem and you let them make it everybody else's problem. Queen Haleana knows about Scott getting the poison sample. What? She's put him in the cells with Varian and Willoway. I think she means to withhold his food, to force him into repairing the complex. Look, I gotta get in there. I need time to analyze that poison. Guards! I found the prisoner. Thank you, Mama. You have received no breakfast, and you will receive no food at all. In a few moments, you'll begin to feel the effects of the poison working in your system. And I guarantee that you'll not be happy about your rebelliousness. You gave me my food, and I didn't cooperate either. The complex may have need of you later. Watch their agony, and then decide whether or not you will help us repair the complex. Will it work? Give me that ampule over there, and we'll see if we can hit the jackpot on the next step. Scott? Marion? Let's start it.
We don't have much time. No. Got it. That's it. Antidote? Only temporary. I can put together a complete antidote to the poison, but first we gotta get out of here. The watches are endangering all my people. You must control them. I do. They are my people. You'll find out I've turned off the illusionary night visitors. You cannot recreate Morgan anymore. How dare you say that? You have even misused me. I will not accept that. I will not let you continue as Queen Haliana. Get a sleep up. You better get yours up too, because you're next. What? That's right. You don't know when you're going to eat next, Johnny. <sighs> yeah. It's the Queen. Let her in. You gotta be kidding. Oh, no, not at all. Connell, would you please? I brought you an antidote for the poison, but I see you have no need of it. For all of your help, we might have died in there. I only did what the complex told me to do. Master Willoway, we need your help. You were right. The complex has gone mad. Well, that's hardly our problem, is it? It's your complex, after all. Jonathan Scott can't stand going through that kind of punishment again if you're not going to cooperate. I can't even move him yet. Look, it, it isn't the lack of compassion I hate. It's the lack of justice. You send your own men off to who knows where. Not that I blame you, but then you... Treat us as badly as they treated you. I'm sorry. I've never ruled before. I, I only knew how to take orders. I, I never learned to give them. You can give us leave to depart. Oh, no, but that's what I mean. I mean, the complex is not going to let you leave. It's gone completely out of control. I mean, you are in as much danger as we are. And I cannot restore it. It, it locked me out of the room. We need you to shut it off. Well, what makes you think that it would let me in? You're a man. The complex was built by men, has always been ordered by men. It knows a woman has heard it. You could gain its confidence. Well, I might get that far, but it is not going to let me turn it off. We could distract it and the watchers. But our weapons will be useless once the complex knows we're trying to destroy the watchers. No, we could confuse it, divert the complex, and attack the watchers. Right. We're going to need everyone to help protect Jonathan. And you'll have to be extra careful, too, because that complex is going to have more defenses than just locking its front door. Well, looks like I've been nominated. Does the complex have any defenses that you know about? Oh, yes. First, to open the complex room, you have to punch a combination on the panel of controls beside the door. From top to bottom, it's four, one, three, two. You hit them once in that order. Four, one, three, two. Oh. Oh. 
uh, are now on the inside. I can show you a schematic of all the laser defense points. That won't help. There is a fail-safe. Fail-safe? Yes. As you near the activation switch in the core, my father told me about it. There's no schematic for it, at least none that I've been able to find. All I know is there's one component in each of the three consoles. These must be removed in exactly the right sequence within 15 seconds, or the entire city will be destroyed. Do you know the components and the sequence? No. No. Oh, good. Why are you here? To help you. I no longer will allow anyone here. But I am a man. I have come to repair the damage done by the woman, Adria. May I enter? You may. You thought to repair me once before, Master Willoway. You told Queen Haliana you could not. Can you restore me now? Uh, I believe so. The readouts will uh, tell you of how much I have worked with computers. I think I have a different way to repair you. After having spoken to Adria and uh, having gotten her father's blueprints on your construction. That sounds reasonable. May I touch this? You may. You all know what to do. Be careful. Let's go. You will restore that component. <laughs> First, you must let me repair the changes that Adria made. Then I can restore your full energy reserves. They are not reporting to me. If I hit that thing, can you take it out with that weapon of yours? Yes, if I can get a shot at its underside. But watch out for its antenna. I'll try to remember.
because you were not programmed to kill people or to try and become a little tin god. I was only doing what I thought best. like our main man finally did it. Yep, and he will never let us forget it either. I am never going to let them forget this. It won't bother you again. We have much to thank you for, Master Willoway. It's all right, Your Majesty. It's just in a day's work. There is one other thing that I would ask of you. Could you activate the complex long enough to bring back our men from prison? What? Please. You... You... You, you mean you, you want them back? I mean, after all that we have been through, after everything that they put you through before we even got here? Oh, really, madam? I'll go down on my knees to you. No, 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 Your Majesty, that... Won't be necessary. That be of service. I asked Willoway to release you from your prison. I was in a place of darkness. I was lost. Once I felt that I returned to you, but... The complex gave me a darkness visitor. You. But not as you were, but as I wanted you to be. You looked on me not as a slave, but as a person that you really cared about. Why can't it always be that way? Why, indeed. But it is time to face reality. Not darkness, visitors. But yourselves as people, real people, who can take on a difficult life. And not as enemies, or masters and slaves, but as equals. I would like to try, Hayana. Together. And I will try. I don't suppose you want this working anymore? Hmm. <clears throat> I uh, hope you don't expect us to call you Master Willoway from now on. No, uh, Dr. Willoway will do. Have a PhD, you know. <laughs> you know, in a way, I both envy and pity any new man who comes into this zone. I mean, there are so many more women here than men. Well, it's all in how one looks at it, Jonathan. Some men can't abide one woman, and other men aren't satisfied with a harem. You will not come this way again. Uh, no, afraid not, we're... 
See, we're headed east and home, we hope. I will miss you.